All right, it's morning here, Sunday morning here in France, making breakfast. Look what I made. Oh, so pretty. So that is a zucchini omelet. It looks pretty good. Excited. <laughs> Suzanne's like, what are you doing? There's Suzanne, Martin, Daniel. You might have seen Martin and Suzanne from Morocco. Daniel, you might have seen from other blogs. Yeah. Full house. This is served. Got lots of berries, cherries. All right, guys, time to eat. So we just had lunch, just taking a little dip before doing some edits, some work, and we're gonna film two videos today. Are you, are you Snapchatting? Yeah. Here's our setup, Alex with two big cameras on the and how beautiful tripod DIY. Yeah, so as Mimi just said, we're just filming our favorites right now, and this is our setup. It's beautiful tripod that I've created from these toy boxes that I found. <laughs> Actually, I found the toy boxes, Alex. Don't take the credit. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> yeah, but I'm excited. I'm gonna be filming my first favorites video ever Woo! today, which you have probably saw by now, because um, I'll post it right now. This is gonna go off after. But I'm catching up on my vlog, because guys, I'm catching up. I'll be there and I told Alex patient. Not to vlog until he had catches up on all the vlogs but somehow you're not listening to me you're still vlogging because it's like if i don't if i do that then i'll miss out on this whole trip and experience and i guys i vlog mostly i'm just be honest with you guys it's for your own memories it's like it's for my memories and uh, what, what i want to talk to you is about do things for yourself and this is the most important thing um, because so many people do things for other people and then when you start doing stuff for other yeah, people awesome. You get lost in that and then you start enjoying why you're doing things in the first place. And so that's just my lesson to you that how I stay happy and just, you know, grateful for the life that I have. I just do things that make me happy and in the end, that's all that matters. And that's why I highly recommend for you to, you know, I, I, I'm not even going to recommend anything. I'm just, it's just how I do things. But let's just start filming this. I just want to show you my last little DIY is I put some napkins in there to create an angle effect. So, yeah, that's This it. is how we do it, do it. All right, so we filmed three videos today. We filmed Mimi's favorites, my favorites. We also filmed an awesome video about the climate drone with UJ, who we're now having a, a topless work session. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I did not know you were gonna do this. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're just enjoying Mimi's cooking. There's little filos. Mimi. Uh, yeah, great day so far. It's a little slow, but we'll get to it. And what I'm really excited about is that we're going to an Indian place. It's gonna be very special. I think so, yeah. Well, I told Panna, another tip for you guys, I use a service called Panna. Uh, full disclosure, Mimi and I are investors. Uh, but Panna is like a concierge, so it, whenever we travel, I just ask them and they make the reservations, they do everything for you, which is pretty cool. So, Panna, check it out. Uh, but yeah, back to work right now while Mimi is cooking. It smells nice. It's so white. What are you cooking? I am making stir fry veggies. I can't get used to this pan because things just burn so fast. Yeah. Because it's electronic, and you know, as soon as you put it on, even to hello. Mimi <laughs> makes the best meals. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so yeah, I'm still getting used to it. It's like one moment I turn away, next moment it's burning. Yeah. So you have to keep your eyes yeah. on. We got some fruit, some melon. 
some rose. Mm. Some Daniel Eskin. Fresh fruit. Mm. Beautiful scenery. Yeah. I'm still like, we've been in this place for over a week. I still can't get over. You can't get over. Daniel, what, what are your thoughts on this? Casa. On this house? Yeah. I'm pretty sure Steve Jobs designed it. It's yeah, super, it's super minimal. It's very like Apple esque. Yeah, it's so yeah. true. Everything's hidden. Like when you when I walk into my room, there's just nothing there. It's all like inside closets and shelves, but it's very, yeah, very futuristic. It's cool. It's like a spaceship. This is good. <laughs> Maybe it was a proactive one here. She's gonna film us here. running out of gas, reacting to running out of gas, <laughs> walking to the gas so station. Here. We're, we're currently driving, and I'm currently showing. And 21 kilometers left before we ran out of gas. We're on the highway. Oh, that's not bad. oh 20 kilometers now. 19 kilometers. Oh my god, oh, it's a oh, gas station. Nobody's searching for the nearest 18 gas station. Kilometers. That's the crazy part. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Alex. It's running out fast. <laughs> Dude, just get to <laughs> Guys, can someone... Yeah, we're heading to the beach, so we're we'll the see. nearest gas station. That's what we need right now. So we still haven't found a gas station. Alex is finding his own. And problem. Alex is very calm and peaceful. I don't think he cares much. Huh? <laughs> UJ and I are freaking <laughs> I'm out. I'm freaking out here. You just guys a, are like, you, just an UJ update. freaks out when he has like 40% battery left. <laughs> <laughs> no, no but it's happened to us before where we ran out of gas in the middle of the street at like rush hour. And the so. worst part is we can't turn our air conditioning on because of it. <laughs> oh, we have air conditioning. Hey, you guys up there, maybe. <laughs> so let's see what. <laughs> exactly. So let's see what happens. I think we can see a gas station. No. Let's just Woo. hope it's open. Yes, it's open. Who wants a bucket of cold water? Woo Me. Woo. We're free. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Smell of gas never smells so good. <laughs> good to go. Good to go. Who? Put Alex on you the whole time. It's fine. He has overreacted. <laughs> well, you can say that yeah. after you've got the gas. Yeah, now it's in high <laughs> So, I just realized I spent some time here on the beach. I didn't even really vlog. It's a nice beach, though. Sun is setting, and we're gonna go eat some Indian food, which I'm really excited about. Did you notice that building is actually the windows are drawn? It's not even real. I was surprised myself, like, what about the rest of the Festivities are in full swing here in Nice. So it's actually UJ's first time in Europe. UJ's in this beautiful square. Yeah, it's definitely hitting me. Yeah? Yeah. So cool, man. How do you feel? I feel different. <laughs> In what way? I feel like the spirit of Europe is slowly starting to seep through me. You know? I got like more relaxed. relaxed. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I feel like the things I can do is going to take a little bit more time. I feel like I'm going to be okay with the coffee. People take longer to actually make coffee. It's fascinating. Yeah. I feel much more insignificant, which I like. Significant. I feel insignificant. Oh, you feel insignificant. I feel that like oceanic feeling of like being in a world where you're just like a tiny speck. Yeah. 
as opposed to North America. Exactly. Because like, it's not the culture is not very developed. What is the culture? Like McDonald's? It's yeah. still right? yeah, it's still baby culture. It's a nonsense culture. <laughs> oh my god. I'm like, I'm about to cut that. <laughs> McDonald's culture. Uh, DJ, if you want to get a Canadian yeah. passport. <laughs> Which one do you want? Lamb Rogan Joe. Lamb Rogan Joe. Lamb Rogan Joe. That's easier. <laughs> uh, Martin? So, Suzanne is taking the prawn malai. Prawn malai. Prawn malai. So, what's uh, that? Which one? Prawn malai. The football seems unreal here. Crazy fans.